Good afternoon. A few days ago, I sat down at my home computer and wrote this email. It was a personal letter that I sent to only my family and friends. And in it, I was venting as any person who's trying to defend her children would do. But I'm not just any mother. I am a mayor of Port St. Lucie, and I was elected by the residents, and therefore the standards are different for me. I'm sorry I wrote this email, and sorry that it is now being used in this way. To the people of Port St. Lucie, I am truly sorry if my private family matters or email have embarrassed the city. However, as the elected mayor of Port St. Lucie, I will not be threatened or intimidated by anyone, especially by special interest groups such as the police union. Long before my son's personal matter arose, the city council knew we had serious budget issues which, reflect, which required difficult decisions. For months, the city attempted to negotiate contracts with the unions that would alleviate further burden to the taxpayers. Furloughs, salary cuts, increases to medical contributions, and unfortunately layoffs have been discussed for months both in negotiations and publicly at city council meetings. I never have taken these decisions lightly and never will. I will remain mayor of Port St. Lucie until my term expires in November. So for the next two and a half months, I will do my job and serve the residents of Port St. Lucie. Thank you.